فلقد يسرنا القرآن للذكر فهل من مدكر السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته إن شاء الله we begin from verse number 23 of سوره السجدة أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم ولقد آتينا موسى الكتاب فلا تكن في مرية من لقائه وجعلناه هدى لبني إسرائيل وجعلنا منهم أئمة يهدون بأمرنا لما صبروا وكانوا بآياتنا يؤمنون إن ربك هو يفصل بينهم يوم القيامة فيما كانوا فيه يختلفون And suddenly we gave Musa al Islam the scripture, that is the Torah. Fala takun fi miriya, so not you be in doubt, millikahi, of his receiving it. And we made it, that is, we made the Torah as a guidance for the children of Israel. And we placed among them aimma, leaders, guiding by our command when they remained patient. And they used to, in our signs, believe with certainty. You know, believe with certainty. Inna Rabbaka huwa yaqsilu bainahum yawm al-qiyamati fi ma kanu fihi yaqtalifun. Verily, your Lord will judge. Verily, your Lord, he will judge between them on the day of Qiyama in what they were in it. Yaqtalifun, differing. Or yaqinan hamne di Musa alayhi salam ko kitab, yana Torah. Pas na tum ہو جانا شک میں اس کے اس کتاب کے ملنے پر اور ہم نے بنایا اس کو یعنی اس کتاب کو ہدایت کا ذریعہ بنی اسرائیل کے لئے اور ہم نے مخرر کیا ان میں پیشوا رہنمائی کرتے تھے ہمارے حکم سے جب وہ صبر بھی کرتے تھے اور وہ ہماری نشانیوں پر یقین رکھتے تھے بے شک آپ کا رب وہی فیصلہ فرمائے گا ان کے درمیان خیامت کے دن جس میں وہ تھے اس میں اختلاف کرتے تو اللہ سبحانہ وتعالی is saying that just as how Prophet صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم you have received the Quran Allah سبحانہ وتعالی is also telling the Jews and the Christians earlier Musa علیہ السلام also received the Torah so not you be in doubt of his receiving the Torah. This is point number one. The second one, according to certain scholars who have interpreted this verse, so do not be in doubt of Prophet ﷺ during Miraj having met Musa ﷺ. And we know the dialogue between Prophet ﷺ and Musa ﷺ, particularly in the matter of the Salah, Namaz ke baare mein Musa ﷺ ka jo ehsas tha ke aap ke khom jo hai pachas wakat ke namaz nahi padhen ge phir usko jo hai dhere dhere kam kar ge panch wakat ke namaz jis par Musa alayhi salam phir bhi apni ehsas zahir karte hoi kehte hai ke panch wakat ke namaz bhi shayad aap ke umat nahi padhen ge you know we know that complete dialogue so some translators have referred it to the liqa'ihi means of his receiving the Torah and some translators and Mufasreen have referred this to the meeting of Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam with Musa Alaihi Wasallam during Miraj. Allahu Akbar. Very important statement which Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala is making is in the Rabbah ka wajah silo bay na hum yawm al kiamati fi ma kano fi yaktali. For not only also in among our Muslim community, there are so many sects, there are so many groups, there are so many differences of opinion between various sections of the Muslim community, and it is bound to happen. It's bound to happen. You have one opinion, I have another opinion. You follow one school of thought, I follow another school of thought. This is bound to happen. But very important is there should not be any discord, internal strife. Aapas ke ikhtilafat aur aapas jo hai ke mud ke jo hai ladai jhagdo se hum apne aapko bachana. This is the most challenging thing to do. Because the shaitan will not allow this community to remain united. We have differences of opinion, but we can respectfully disagree. Yeah, please underline this word. We can respectfully disagree. There should not be any tutu mehme. They're not necessary at all. And we cannot be become judgmental about anybody else following another school of thought. हम इस पर राय पर जो है नहीं पहुंच सकते कि हम ही जो है बिल्कुल सही है और हमारा ही मसलक बिल्कुल परफेक्ट है औरों का सब जो है बातिल है we can't do that. We can't say that. 
every school of thought has its own evidence to back it leave it you are satisfied with a particular school of thought you are satisfied to work with a particular organization continue but never speak bad or sling mud at another person following another school of thought or a person working for any other organization tum jis maslak ko follow karna chahte ho tumhe pura azadi hai tumhare shar e sadar ke mutabik you are happy you are comfortable and you are satisfied with this particular school of thought you want to follow the humble school of thought you want the maliki school of thought you want to follow the hanfi school of thought tumhe jo hai shafi school of thought you want to follow ahle hadith school of thought you are at liberty to do so but never claim or make a loud noise about it and say that only my maslak is right and rest of all batil this is not allowed so then who will judge which was right and which was wrong allah will judge on the day of qiyamah as long as our niyat is that we should follow the best principles of islam and follow the best method shown by the beloved prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam that's it there may be small mistakes here and there no problem but as long as we remain united that's the larger benefit that we need to safe guard for our community because aajkal chote chote mamlon mein hum ulajh jate hain aur is tarah ulajh jate hain ki gali guloch par nobat aa jati hai ikhtilafat itne badh jate hain ki intishar paida ho jata hai aur the larger benefit and good of keeping the community united gets destroyed and who's the winner shaitan who gave him space we gave him space kisne usko jagah di humne usko jagah di शैतान के मकरो फरेब में हम आ गए और हम जज्बाती हो जाते हैं वी बिकम इमोशनल वी थिंक वी ओनली नो द बेस्ट अबाउट रिलीजन द ऑपोजिट पर्सन इज इग्नोरेंट वी आर ओनली फॉलोइंग द हक एंड द बात सॉरी दिस नॉट द वे ये तरीका थोड़ी होता हुल जज देन अल्लाह विल जज एम यू नीड टू पे टू अल्लाह सुबह अल्लाह हेल्प टू प्रैक्टिस इस्लाम इन द राइट वे As shown by the beloved Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, Allah will automatically guide us. Allah se bar bar humko madad chate rana. Ye baat lekar mat bato ke solve everything is okay. Noi, Shaitan will somehow try to lead you astray. Become be very careful and never become judgmental about anybody. Don't become reactionary. Don't get provoked. Don't get into tutu meme. Don't get into conflicts. Don't get into controversies. All your resources, time, money, energy will all get drained out, and you're creating disunity, which is a big crime. It's a major sin. इंतजार पैदा करना उम्मत में सबसे बड़ा गुना है आप अपनी बात सामने लोगों के रख सकते हो लेकिन किसी पर मुसलत नहीं कर सकते यू कैंट इम्पोज इट यू आर हैव एवरी राइट टू प्रेजेंट योर पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू ऑन योर ओपिनियन यू हैव एवरी राइट टू सो यू हैव नो राइट टू इम्पोज इट ऑन एनी बडी अबलम यह दिल हम कम आलकना is it not a guidance for them kam ahlakna how many we destroyed from before them of the generations or of the communities they walk in their masakinihim their dwellings or their habitations when they in that surely are signs do they not they listen kya nahi hai unke liye hidayat kitne humne hila kiya inse pehle qaumon ko वो चलते फिरते हैं उनके आबादियों में बेशक इसमें जरूर निशानियां हैं फिर क्या नहीं वो सुनते हैं कितने हमने कौमों को हिला के ऐसे पहले उनके किबर की वजह से उनके वक्त के रसूल और नबी के इनकार करने की वजह से शिर की वजह से <coughs> اولم يروا ان نسوخ الماء الى الارض الجرز فنخرج به زرعا تاكل منه انعامهم وانفسهم افلا يبصرون do they not see that we drive the water towards the land dry فنخرج به زرعا then we bring forth with it crops eat of it their cattle وانفسهم and their own selves do they not they see क्या वो नहीं देखते कि हम चलाते हैं पानी को सूखी पड़ी हुई जमीन की तरफ फिर हम निकालते हैं उसके जरिए से खेतियां 
کھاتے ہیں اس سے ان کے مویشیاں اور وہ خود بھی پھر کیا نہیں وہ دیکھتے وہ یقول و نمتا حاض الفتح ان کن تم صادقین کل یوم الفتح لا ین فا اللہ نہ کفر و ایمان و لاحم یون ضرون فارض انہم و انتظر انہم منتظرون and they ask متا حاض الفتح when is this promise ان کن تم صادقین if you are truthful say the day of the decision sorry and they ask when is this decision going to happen if you are truthful say the day of the decision not shall benefit those who disbelieve iman on their faith and not they will be given yunzarun respite so turn away from them and wait verily they too are waiting aur wo puchte hain kab hai ye faisle ka waqt agar ho tum sachche keh dijiye فیصلے کا دن نہیں فائدہ دے گا ان لوگوں کو جنہوں نے کفر کیا جنہوں نے جنہوں نے انکار کیا ان کا ایمان نہیں فائدہ دے گا ان لوگوں کو جنہوں نے انکار کیا ان کا ایمان دے آنا اور نہ وہ ان کو مولت دی جائے گی بس اعراض کرو ان سے اور انتظار کرو بے شک وہ بھی انتظار کر رہے ہیں میں اللہ سمت اللہ ایکسپٹ سو رہے تو سجدہ فرما in our recitation translation understanding and implementation or sorry explanation may allah pardon and forgive each one of us amen we start a new surah suratul ahzab <clears throat> his uh, is singular ahzab is plural his means a group a party ahzab means a group of people many groups whom we generally translate as confederates confederates means those people who are hostile to islam those groups of people who are hostile to islam wo kai groh jaise yahudi the isai the aur phir mushrikin the munafiqin the ye sab jo hai ehzab mein aate hain aur ye sab islam dushman groh hain to allah subhanahu wa taala ان کے بارے میں اس سورے میں ڈسکس کر رہا ہے اللہ سبحانہ اللہ از گوئنگ ٹو ڈس ڈسکسنگ اباؤٹ دس پارٹیکولر کانفیڈریٹس دیس گروپس ہو ہاسٹائل ٹو اسلام ان دس پارٹیکولر سورا اینڈ ا ویری امپورٹنٹ ایسپیکٹ اف دس سورا از اللہ ٹاکس اباؤٹ دی بیٹل اف احزاب دس وی نو از دی تھرڈ بیٹل فوٹ انڈر دی بینر اف اسلام دی فرسٹ واز بیٹل اف بدر فالوڈ بائی بیٹل اف ود and then about battle of azab inshallah we'll discuss about this battle of azab in tomorrow evening class i'll give you a brief description of what this particular battle was all about what were the issues how the particular battle took place what happened during the process when the battle was on what happened during the battle and what was the final outcome of this battle and what were the kind of circumstances and issues the muslim community at in madina faced and how allah subhanahu wa ta'ala came to the rescue inshallah we will discuss this in tomorrow evening's class